unveiling ultra-terrestrial monsters of our haunted planet. On a fog-laden night in rural West Virginia, a couple swore they saw glowing red eyes staring back at them from the woods. Their hearts raced. A towering figure with wings emerged, then vanished into the mist. To this day, the sighting remains unexplained and profoundly chilling. Ultra-terrestrial refers to beings that originate from dimensions beyond our own, unlike extraterrestrials who hail from other planets. They are thought to exist parallel to our reality, occasionally crossing over into our world, leaving behind perplexing mysteries and eerie encounters. Throughout history, various cultures have reported encounters with mysterious creatures. Ancient Egyptians spoke of gods with animal heads, while medieval Europeans recorded sightings of dragons. These reports often blur the line between myth and reality, hinting at something otherworldly lurking in the shadows. Unlike extraterrestrials, who are believed to travel across vast cosmic distances, ultraterrestrials are thought to coexist unseen within our own world, emerging from hidden dimensions. This distinction makes them even more enigmatic, as their appearances are spontaneous and often linked to specific locations. The Mothman of Point Pleasant is one of the most famous ultraterrestrial cases. In the 1960s, numerous residents reported seeing a large, winged creature with glowing red eyes. The sightings culminated in the tragic collapse of the Silver Bridge, leading many to believe the Mothman was a harbinger of doom. The Jersey Devil, a creature believed to haunt the Pine Barrens of New Jersey, has been the subject of terrifying tales for over 200 years. Described as having a kangaroo-like body, bat wings, and a horse's head, it allegedly emerges from the shadows to terrify residents and travelers alike. The chupacabra, originating from Latin American folklore, is said to prey on livestock, draining their blood. First reported in Puerto Rico in the 1990s, this creature is often described as reptilian with spines along its back. Its name, meaning goat sucker, reflects the gruesome nature of its attacks. Folklore and legends about mysterious creatures span cultures and continents, from the Loch Ness Monster in Scotland to the Yeti in the Himalayas. These stories often serve as cautionary tales, reflecting societal fears and the mysteries of the natural world passed down through generations. Scientific theories propose various explanations for these sightings, including misidentifications of known animals, psychological phenomena, or the influence of environmental factors. Some scientists suggest that ultra-terrestrial creatures could be undiscovered species, while others argue they are products of the human imagination. Cryptozoology, the study of hidden animals, seeks to investigate these elusive creatures. Cryptozoologists compile reports, analyze evidence, and conduct field research in hopes of proving the existence of beings like Bigfoot or the Loch Ness Monster. Despite skepticism, the field continues to captivate the public's imagination. People from all walks of life have shared vivid eyewitness accounts of encounters with ultra-terrestrial beings. These testimonies often describe strange creatures with otherworldly features and behaviors that defy conventional explanation. The consistency and detail in these stories make them hard to dismiss as mere flights of imagination. Certain locations around the globe have become hotspots for ultra-terrestrial sightings. Areas like the Scottish Highlands, West Virginia, and the Pine Barrens of New Jersey are well known for frequent reports of mysterious beings. These regions attract researchers and thrill-seekers, all hoping to catch a glimpse of the unknown. Government involvement in ultra-terrestrial investigations has been a topic of speculation for years. There are reports of official inquiries and classified documents that suggest authorities might be more aware of these phenomena than they publicly admit. This veil of secrecy fuels further curiosity and conspiracy theories. Modern technology plays a crucial role in documenting ultra-terrestrial sightings. High-definition cameras, drones, and night vision equipment have captured compelling evidence that intrigues both believers and skeptics. Social media platforms enable instant sharing of these sightings, reaching a global audience and sparking widespread discussion. Human psychology significantly influences how we perceive ultra-terrestrial sightings. The power of suggestion, confirmation bias, and the innate human desire to find patterns can lead to misinterpretations of natural phenomena. Understanding these psychological factors helps to distinguish between genuine encounters and the tricks our minds can play on us. The media plays a significant role in shaping our perception of ultra-terrestrial monsters. Movies, TV shows, and books often dramatize these creatures, making them more frightening and mysterious. 
This sensationalism can blur the lines between fact and fiction, influencing public opinion and fueling the fascination with these enigmatic beings. Ultraterrestrial monsters have a set of common characteristics that make them stand out. Often described as elusive and otherworldly, they possess unique features like glowing eyes, unusual skin textures, and extraordinary abilities. These traits make them captivating subjects of folklore and modern-day sightings, perpetuating their mystique across generations. Debunked cases add an interesting layer to the study of ultra-terrestrials. Famous incidents, once believed to be genuine, have been exposed as hoaxes. These revelations provide a critical perspective, reminding us that not all mysterious sightings are unexplainable and urging a more skeptical approach to new reports. Despite numerous investigations, some ultra-terrestrial cases remain unsolved mysteries. These enduring enigmas keep the intrigue alive, leaving both believers and skeptics pondering the unknown. The lack of conclusive evidence in these instances fuels ongoing debates and inspires further exploration into the realms of the unexplained. Ultra-terrestrial creatures significantly impact local cultures. Legends and folklore surrounding them become integral parts of community identity and heritage. Festivals, rituals, and stories passed down through generations reflect the deep-rooted fascination and reverence for these mysterious beings, demonstrating their enduring influence on human imagination and cultural expression. Survivor stories offer a fascinating glimpse into the lives of those who claim to have encountered ultra-terrestrial beings. These accounts often involve vivid descriptions of the creatures, the circumstances of the encounter, and the lasting impact on the individuals involved. Such stories can be both harrowing and captivating, leaving listeners intrigued. Skeptics argue against the existence of ultra-terrestrials, citing lack of empirical evidence and the possibility of misidentifications. They often point to psychological factors, such as pareidolia, as explanations. Despite these arguments, the debate continues, with both sides presenting compelling points that fuel ongoing discussions and investigations. Believers in ultra-terrestrials present arguments rooted in historical sightings, cultural myths, and personal testimonies. They contend that the sheer volume and consistency of these reports across different regions and eras suggest a genuine phenomenon. This perspective encourages further exploration and a more open-minded approach to the unknown. Paranormal investigation groups employ various methods to explore ultra-terrestrial phenomena, including field research, interviews, and the use of specialized equipment. These groups aim to gather evidence that can either support or debunk reported encounters. Their work often brings new insights and keeps the mystery alive for both skeptics and believers. Photographic evidence of ultra-terrestrial creatures is often met with skepticism and intrigue. Analysts scrutinize these images for signs of manipulation or natural explanations. While many photos are debunked, some remain unexplained, adding to the allure and mystery surrounding these enigmatic beings and keeping the public's curiosity piqued. Video evidence of ultra-terrestrial creatures often stirs both excitement and skepticism. Analyzing these recordings involves scrutinizing the footage for authenticity, looking for signs of digital manipulation, and consulting experts. High-definition cameras and drones have captured compelling yet controversial clips, fueling debates about their legitimacy and the true nature of these beings. Famous researchers in the field of ultra-terrestrials have dedicated their lives to uncovering the truth. Figures like John Keel and Lauren Coleman have extensively documented sightings and theories. Their work has inspired both academic and amateur investigations, adding credibility and depth to the mysterious world of ultra-terrestrial studies. Cryptid classifications help organize the diverse range of ultra-terrestrial monsters reported worldwide. From winged humanoids to aquatic beasts, these categories aid researchers in identifying patterns and similarities. Understanding these classifications allows for more systematic investigations and helps in comparing new sightings with historical cases, offering potential insights. Ultra-terrestrial monsters have a significant influence on pop culture, appearing in movies, books, and video games. These creatures captivate audiences, blending fear and fascination. Their presence in media perpetuates their legend, inspiring new generations to explore the unknown and question the boundaries of our reality. Scientific skepticism plays a vital role in the study of ultra-terrestrials. Mainstream scientists often demand empirical evidence and reproducible results. 
This cautious approach ensures that claims are rigorously tested, separating fact from fiction. While skepticism can be a barrier, it also drives more robust and credible research efforts in the field. Patterns and sightings often reveal common themes, such as specific geographical locations, particular seasons, or recurring descriptions of the creatures. Many reports describe nocturnal activity, glowing eyes, and eerie sounds. These patterns help researchers identify hotspots and develop theories about the behavior and origins of these mysterious beings. Public reactions to sightings vary widely, from fear and skepticism to fascination and excitement. Some communities treat these encounters as folklore, organizing festivals and tours. Others may experience panic, prompting local authorities to issue warnings. Reactions often depend on cultural beliefs and previous experiences with similar phenomena. Laws and regulations concerning ultra-terrestrial creatures are rare but exist in some places. Certain areas have specific ordinances to protect supposed habitats or to prevent hoaxes. These regulations often aim to balance public interest with safety, ensuring that curiosity does not lead to harm or legal issues. Famous hoaxes have significantly impacted the study of ultra-terrestrials, often casting doubt on legitimate sightings. Notable examples include fabricated photos and staged encounters that gain media attention. While these hoaxes can discredit genuine research, they also highlight the need for rigorous investigation and verification of evidence. Biological possibilities of these creatures are a subject of scientific debate. Some researchers propose that certain ultra-terrestrials could be undiscovered species or evolutionary anomalies. Others argue that environmental factors could produce creatures with unusual traits. While speculative, these theories encourage further exploration and open-mindedness in the scientific community. While the existence of ultra-terrestrial creatures challenges conventional biology, some scientists argue their survival could be possible through unknown adaptations or evolutionary paths. These creatures might possess abilities or traits that are yet to be discovered, suggesting that our understanding of Earth's biodiversity remains incomplete and full of intriguing mysteries. We invite you to share your own encounters and experiences with ultra-terrestrial beings. Your stories could help us uncover more about these elusive creatures and build a community of curious minds dedicated to exploring the unknown. Every shared experience adds a piece to the puzzle of these mysterious entities. In conclusion, ultra-terrestrial creatures continue to captivate our imagination and challenge our understanding of the natural world. From scientific skepticism to compelling eyewitness accounts, the debate around their existence remains vibrant. As we explore these phenomena, we remain open to the possibility of discovering new dimensions of our reality. We extend our gratitude to the sources and contributors who made this exploration possible. Their insights, research, and dedication have enriched our understanding of ultra-terrestrial creatures. Acknowledging their work ensures that we continue to build on the foundation they have laid in this fascinating field. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the world of ultra-terrestrial creatures. We hope you found it as intriguing as we did. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to stay updated on our latest investigations and discussions. Your participation fuels our quest for the truth.